When you click on trends, you arrive at a landing page with two graphs. The one on the left shows global spending on development assistance for health in billions of US dollars, according to health focus areas from 1990 through 2019. The one on the right shows the percentage change in spending on the same health focus areas over the period 2010 through 2019. A small icon in the top right corner of each graph can be used to enlarge each graph to a full page and then reset it to its original size. Placing the cursor over any coloured segment in the left hand graph will open a box showing the value of development assistance for health for that health focus area in that particular year. On the right hand graph the boxes show the percentage increase or decrease in spending for each health focus area for the period of time selected. In the bottom left hand corner the stacked drop down menu which pops up can be used to select different formats for the graph above. The default stacked setting can be changed to separated, percentage or totals which also changes the right hand graph and can then be reset to stacked. To the right of the stacked drop down menu there are options to select different graph topics such as the source of development assistance for health financing, the channel through which it is funneled, the region where it is used or to return to the health focus graph. Beneath these option buttons, the filter by drop down menu can be used to further focus the information displayed by source, channel and region. Selecting any of these headings will give access to another drop down menu to the right which will display another level of options. If for instance regions is selected in the left drop down menu, then the right drop down menu can be used to select one of nine regional options. Click on the health focus button to return to the default setting. Underneath the right hand graph there are two controls. The one on the left allows the change in development assistance for health being shown to be expressed either as a percentage change or as absolute change. The year range slider can be used to set the start and end years of the information being displayed above.